testimony continues from breathing experts today at the trial of Derek Chauvin, the former police officer in Minneapolis accused of the murder in the death of George Floyd. A pulmonologist today saying it is a false sense of security to think that Floyd must have had enough oxygen because he was talking, saying, I can't breathe. Five seconds later, the expert says a person can stop breathing. You're seeing here fatal injury to the brain from a lack of oxygen. Let's talk now with our legal analyst, LaFonda Middleton, 25 years experience in the courtroom as a local attorney and a graduate of the University of Florida Law School. So thanks for joining us tonight, Ms. Middleton. A big headline today, a pulmonologist testified for the prosecution and said a healthy person restrained like George Floyd, quote, would have died. Now, how does the defense counter that? The defense's job is to create this entire smoke and mirror uh, kind of effect. Uh, so they will take any non-issue and make it an issue. So they probably will just completely disregard what the stop has said. What do you think is the most damaging thing to the defense, to Chauvin, so far from the state? That tactic that Chauvin used was not part of their training. and It was definitely excessive force. This is a problem that the defense will have to overcome. Ms. Middleton, thank you so much for giving us insight for, from all of your expertise. And I know you will be helping us all during this trial as the world watches. And you can find the latest, by the way, on trial updates on our First Coast News app.